yes, yes, yes. My still colors family. How are you doing? How is everyone feeling right now? Talk to me. Is everyone good? How are you feeling? Um, I am back again. I am Jarvis and we are back with another reaction video and we're taking it back to where it first started. To the, to the band I first listened to, who I started my journey with, and we're getting back into some Pink Floyd. Um, I thought I'd switch up today, because um, it's been quite a while since like I've reacted to a music video. So I've decided to react to the music video for High Hopes by Pink Floyd. Um, I've got high hopes, because I know what Pink Floyd I like. Okay, I know the type of excellence that they bring to a microphone, to a track, to a studio session, so I'm excited. I'm, I'm, I'm eager because this track is seven minutes long, so I'm eager to hear what we're going to hear. Um, but enough of me talking, let's just get into it. Let us get straight into this business. High hopes. Desire and ambition 
There's a hunger still unsatisfied Our weary eyes still stray to the horizon Go down this road we've been so many times The grass was green and First of all, let me say, I had to write notes. I had so many thoughts going through my head. I had to write them down because I would have forgotten it. Okay, I would have forgotten it. Um, let's start with the first thing, the music video. What a beautiful video. Like, in terms of like, it's, there were expressionism, in terms of visually, just beautiful, simple, because it, it was just, they were just in the country. It was just a couple people in the country doing a couple things. And what what they did, or what I liked is the symbolism that went with the lyrics. Like sometimes we were super literal and sometimes there was a little bit, a little bit more symbolism to it. So like I wrote a bit of notes. So for example, one thing that I thought was interesting is the, the, the guitars in the water. Um, and when we was, uh, I, th I think at that moment we were talking about like dreams going adrift or something along those lines. Um, the men in suits, I think we were talking about like controlling our lives, like that type of, like that type of vibe, 
you know, when um, when when he said the grass is greener and then we had the children playing. Do you know what I mean? It was that innocence, that fun, you know, that, you know, they're literally playing in grass. I think they were, they were throwing the balloons around and such. Um, but, you know, it was just that, 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 that beautiful, fun feeling of, you know, being a child and playing. Um, the cloaks in the air is a really interesting one as well, because it seemed like the cloaks were like, the, especially that black cloak, that massive black cloak looked beautiful, but also looked like it was holding that guy back. Like when I think of cloaks and stuff, I think of like superheroes and stuff. And he did not look like a superhero. He looked like someone who was being held back by the weight of his, maybe the weight of his power. Maybe, maybe that's what it meant. Maybe that's what it symbolized. Um, and do you know what I thought was really interesting as well is, you know, the, twa- the taste was sweeter. And then we see like a little kid, you know, holding a teddy bear, a massive teddy bear. And then after that, we, I think it's, we found Surrender. And then the teddy bear was just like thrown out of the window. So uh, I'm trying to understand what that meant. Um, in terms of the instrumentation, oh my God, it felt like a ballad, uh, epic drama. It, 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 it was just so, it, I was taken on a journey. It, and <laughs> I can't even, like the guitar, oh my God. One thing about Pink Floyd, the guitars, oh my God. And this one was a bit more subtle. Like it came up a lot more towards the end of the track, but it was it was beautiful. Absolute, oh my God. Absolutely beautiful. Like, mm, beautiful. Beautiful. So to me, like the overall vibe I'm getting, obviously after watching the video, after seeing a couple of the symbolisms, you know, like the guitar going down the stream, the balloons flying away in the air, the teddy bear getting thrown out of the window. It kind of feels like there's a bit of like a, not a regretful tone, but like a nostalgic energy, a looking back and it's looking at life that used to be sweet and it's not as sweet. Like the main guy in the video, he's just sitting there looking, looking back. We see his face for like one scene and it's half of his face. He's just sitting there looking reflectively. And that makes me think he's thinking of a time with nostalgia, with regret, I guess, I guess all, almost with a bit of regret. Um, at, you know, how things have changed over time. That's the way I'm feeling. Um, but let me know if I'm right. Let me know your thoughts, educate me, help me out. Um, please don't forget to comment, don't forget to rate, and don't forget to subscribe. It's your boy Jarvis. Until the next time, adios, my people. We found surrender. Ooh, ooh, ooh.